Tuggy here in the Shire. Today we're going to look at um, WSO, which is Wormwood System Observatories. Wormwood has been in the Destroyer, uh, connected to Nibiru, uh, Planet X, Herculobus, uh, Blue Kachina, Red Kachina, you know, that nonsense. Anyway, um... I was looking at um, a video that a Space Cadet had uploaded about um, WSO's uh, YouTube statistics, um, this little bit of it here. Um, anyway, I was watching it and then suddenly it panned to a video which was taken on the 30th of July. Um, some footage of a lens flare. And I thought, hmm, I've seen that picture before. I know exactly what that is. It's the brown dwarf that um, Scott Cohn is pushing. So here's a little bit of Space Cadet's video. And then we'll pan to uh, the pictures of Scott Cohn's and do a comparison. So I was going through this video and come across this image here, this one here. Doesn't that look like to you Scott Cohn of the Nibiru Channel's new brown dwarf, which he's supposed to have got from a subscriber in Germany. Seriously, these are orbs. Oh, it's pretty incredible, really, that you've got a theoretical particle physicist who claims to be a Planet X researcher, and they're looking at orbs, which are caused by digital cameras, and trying to pass them off as um, planets. This woman is a theoretical particle physicist with numerous degrees, so we're told, and a PhD, blah, 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 and they're passing off orbs as planets and selling papers, white papers, online. You know, the second day that she um, sold her paper, they were selling papers, they were selling their papers. She netted $2,450. That should make you think, really, shouldn't it? That it, it's just beggar's belief, doesn't it? That people are so stupid to believe her. That's the brainwashing and zombified mentality of YouTube and social media. People don't think anymore. They just don't. They just take what folks say and think that it's gospel. Sad, really. Anyway, um, took it out.